monkey is electrocuted. Is it moving or is it just hanging there? So it's still alive. The monkey was um, still on the lines when she phoned and had been electrocuted. And um, it's now fallen down off the lines. There's right a here. transformer here. Stephen. Genevieve. Did you call us? Yes. Thank you so much, Genevieve. Thank you. Oh, little girl. Oh, my word. Uh, it's going to be a fight. No, I don't think so. Unfortunately, no, unfortunately she's cooked she's, inside as well. She's cooked. She's, she's in a very bad way. Um, you can see her hands are completely burnt. She will have taken the full 11,000 volts into her body. Um, so much so that she's actually tripped out the electricity. Okay. No doubt. Or, okay. Unfortunately, the best thing we can do for her is euthanize her and take her away the pain. So, okay. She's bad, no? Oh, she is bad. Oh, shame. No, we're not going to fit the name. Her hand is already cooked. Okay, my baby. Mm. We're not going. The monkey that's lying up there that's not even sedated has already got severe injuries inside. We've seen this too many times. What happens is that electrical current doesn't burn on the surface. The body is a conductor for the current, so the current runs right through the whole body at that strength. Uh, she's not going to make it, so we're just going to do humane euthanasia. And we can do that by means of an intracardiac injection. Just to see if we're in the heart. Uh, yes, there we go. Okay, so there's blood, blood coming back in the needle. So we should be in the heart. We just inject. And if we were in the right place, she should go very quickly. Good girl. Okay, it looks like she stopped breathing already, so that's how quick it is. Sadly, we had to euthanize that young female. Um, the damage done from the electrocution was far too severe. There's no way she could survive. She was going to definitely lose one hand, one foot, and more than likely the other hand. Monkeys are a part of the urban landscape. And of course, the urban landscape is crisscrossed with electric power lines bringing power to people's homes. And when those lines are carrying 11,000 volts like they do here, then the monkey stands very little chance of surviving that. This is a vervet monkey that's been electrocuted on a, a high voltage, 11,000 volt electricity power lines. The fact is what you see on the surface here is duplicated inside the monkey. Its organs are, 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 are burnt um, and it suffers horrendous injuries. And you can only imagine the suffering that this animal has to endure during the period of time it takes for the animal to die as a consequence of these injuries.